Hello, friends, and welcome to another episode of the Defiance Rebels. Here is your host, Plain Pants. Ooh, there's an attack going on right now. Hold on a second. Kurt, what are you doing, Kurt? This is highly irregular. <laughs> oh, I can't speed it up. I'm bored already. Hold on. So... <laughs> well, if I didn't know better, I'd say he has a good chance of closing this out. Except this flare's a little fucked up. In my opinion. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Kind of calling it real time. Like, I have no idea what's going to happen. It's like calling it... A... Like a spectator sport. <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, we meet again in the Ballast Stadium, and uh, Kurt is attacking the shit out of a big metal cylinder for no apparent reason. <laughs> Cannons are shooting at completely unarmed women, <laughs> yielding bazookas that are heavier than they are. <laughs> that magically have infinite bullets that come a as if they're at the farts of angels. <laughs> Did you see that? Oh. Did you see how the little lightning was coming out? The little lightning was coming out <laughs> of the core when it was destroyed? That's just cool. All right. I want to look at... I think it's this. I think it's... Th I think it's this. Yes. This is the video I had planned on talking about. This is the video of Destroyer. And this reminded me of the motto of Boom Beach. Which is, come with a plan or leave in defeat. And look at Destroyer. He knew exactly what he was going to do. He thought about the first flare, second flare. He probably thought about how long it would last, how many flares it would take him from get to get from the boats to there. Then this third flare. Let's him round that corner to square up against those cannons. The Zookas will never get touched. It's attacks like this that really help. I, I gotta say, I mean, you know, you could argue, nah, this one was basically dead anyways. I don't even come in and kind of <laughs> dead done. But that's not true. Sometimes there's readjustment. And he's going to get the win. I think it's even cooler when people think out these closing attacks. Because those are the ones that cost two, three attacks extra per base. When someone who assumes that they can close it out just kind of bites the shit. Because they figure they could just rush it. Look at Destroyer getting a little fucking zesty. <laughs> a little pompous, a little hubris, a little smoke at the end. 